fans, and welcome to Boilermaker All Access. I'm Tyler Carter, and today we are with Nick Mondek, offensive guard. Nick, last week you guys are coming off of a bye. What were some of the things that the team was able to work on during practice? You know, we worked on everything from pass to run. Uh, and just, you know, getting those extra practices really helped us. You know, just playing, just working on our technique and just go, going after and getting ready for Notre Dame. What were some of the things that you were able to personally work on during this week? For me, using my hands, for shooting my hands and punching and pass pro and pass protection. Um, that's, about, that's what I really focused on this week. Do you think it was more beneficial for you to have the bye week this early in the season as opposed to having it later on when you come into conference play? I definitely. Um, we're, you know, Notre Dame's a big game. We're getting ready for them. And for, like, me, i just getting healthy and getting get my legs back under me. And just, hopefully it'll just keep, keep pay off for the next game, the next game, the next game. So. Was there anything in particular in practice that you guys were able to work out to correct for this game on Saturday? Um... Not necessarily anything particular, you know, just, just polishing things up, you know, just, just reemphasizing the little things and just working, going back to the fundamentals and starting back from the beginning and just getting, just going through everything and make sure everything's perfect. Is there anything in particular that the offensive line is going to look out for when coming against Notre Dame's defense? Well, Notre Dame plays an oaky front, so, you know, we've been preparing for that. And that's, that's what we've really been working on this week. And then also they're even front, you know, so we're ready for whatever they throw at us. The Purdue-Notre Dame game is one of the most traditional games that Purdue has. Why do you think this game is so special to this program and also to the Purdue community? Just being uh, both in state schools, you know, that's a big deal. And then, um, I don't know, I mean, just, just being an in-state game. You know, we're close, and it's just kind of a pride, pride thing. And so, Thank you, Nick, and good luck this weekend. For much. Boilermaker All Access, I'm Tyler Carter. How's it going, Boilermakers? I'm Lauren Lapka here talking to Ricardo Allen, sophomore cornerback. Ricardo, you are have a big game coming up this week. Notre Dame's one of the hardest teams on the schedule. What have you guys been doing to prepare? Um, just practicing hard, um, getting the plays down, and just, that's really it. <laughs> All right. And after having a bye week, do you feel that you've been able to pre prepare some more, or is this going to come at a disadvantage for you guys? Um, I think it was an advantage because it helps us get fresh. It helps us like have time off and things like that. Helps us get a, like a good jump on them, so it came to an advantage. All right, how do you personally feel the season's going so far? Um, I think it's going okay. I really don't like the loss, but we still won more, more and we lost. <laughs> okay, that sounds good. All right, and we have an undefeated record at home right now. How can you guys and what can we do as fans to keep that record going? Um, just come and show the support and. That's us fans and us just play as hard as we can and just keep it going. All right. Well, good luck this weekend. Reporting for Boilermaker All Access, I'm Lauren Lapka.